to run the football as well. Well, just like that, it's third and ten. Here they come. They come at Gallitz. It's a screen play. They've got Tomlin out here, but he can't get free. He gets about to the 31, 32 yard line, and uh, Jaquil Tomlin could not get free. Defense all over it, and that brings up fourth down, and they're going to have to punt it out. Really good play call because the defensive line all suckered and went with their wide side flip screen, and they came back with the underneath screen, but the guard kind of got hung up getting out, and he's responsible for that outside linebacker. Didn't quite get to him, and that didn't allow Jaquil to get past him and hopefully have a chance to run for a first down. Fourth and nine, here comes the punt. It's another beauty, good punt, but this time he's going to go for it. He catches it on the run, and he had a head of steam going finally. He got tackled out there. A nice tackle by Jamil Iacopo. And first and 10 for the Tigers at their 48-yard line. And they've scored on their last two possessions. So, you know, they're starting to feel it now with 4.56 left in this half. Well, and that's your biggest fear is them starting to get in some sort of a flow offensively and then giving them the short field of, you know, kicking. Last series was only 44 yards. This one's basically only going to be 53 yards to pay dirt because they start at their own 47-yard line. Good field position breeds aggressive play calling, and that's what Coach Kraft is known for. Under five to go. Can the Renegades just hang on and get out of here?